exactly what happened in the incident itself. The crash scene from the ground. Traffic is slowly getting by, but it is, of course, five o'clock in the afternoon on a weekday. State police tweeted this picture. If you can avoid that area, do we have a crew on the scene? We'll bring you more information throughout New Center 5 tonight. And we're also following this story. A woman under arrest charged with the murder of a young Westminster man. That woman went before a judge today, and our Nicole Burley joins us live with the breaking details at 5. Nicole? Well, and, and Emily, right now we know the woman charged with the murder knew Brandon Chickless, but today prosecutors did not release details about how he died. Julia Enright of Ashburnham is charged with the murder of Brandon Chickless of Westminster. A body was discovered by a jogger on the side of Route 119 in Orange, New Hampshire. Chickless's body was found earlier this month, just miles from where his car had been found abandoned in a parking lot late last month. Mr. Chickless's cell phone records placed him at 171 Packard Hill Road in Ashburnham, Massachusetts on June 23rd. That address is Enright's home, although prosecutors did not detail the nature of their relationship, other than to say they were classmates and, quote, knew each other. Enright's property was searched extensively. While executing the search warrants, they, at that address, they located a treehouse which was near the property. Numerous items were seized for forensic analysis. And that analysis gave prosecutors the evidence they needed. It was determined that the victim's blood was present on the stairs leading to the treehouse, on the inside of the treehouse, under the treehouse, and in the defendant's vehicle. Now, in a sad twist of fate, today would have been Brandon's 21st birthday. And Wright is due back in court next month. She is currently being held without bail. Reporting live from Gardner District Court, Nicole Burley, WCVB News Center 5.